guys, it's Will and Laura. Uh, we're here at 1225 Saddleback and just gonna take you through a tour of this gorgeous home. <laughs> Laura's waving hello. Okay, so there's the garage, two car, one car over there. We're gonna take a separate trip into the outbuilding over there. But for now, let's go ahead and go inside the house. Chris, the listing agent, is just making sure it's all free of debris. Say hello, Chris. Hello there. <laughs> all right, so entryway. Gorgeous, it is radiant heat floors. I'll show you the system in the garage there. Lighting fixtures are wonderful. Okay, so it does include all the furniture. Everything you see in the video is coming with the property. I'll take you out there in a second. We'll see the creek. Okay, this is uh, really nice. The live edge granite. It definitely costs more. It's a real nice feature. Click top. All right, so here's the wood stove in here. Uh, listing agent Chris did say that it would be easy to, there's propane on site, so it would be easy to um, add a gas or propane stove there instead. Even this tile is really nice. Okay, so vaulted ceilings, gorgeous. All right, so let's go on through. There is a screened room out here, sitting room. I hope you can hear that in the video. That's the creek down below, the rushing creek. I'll take you over, zoom in on that. Okay, so let's go on through to some of the other rooms. Pull out drawers, that's nice. Spice rack or holding rack there, let's see. Again, as we understand it, all these, everything in the house comes with the house. A downdraft vent, it's all hooked up. So, okay, get that back down. There's some other documents here that are pertinent. Now, it does come with a neighboring lot, and I'll show you that outside. So, the that focus the lot on the right gives you some extra space there okay all right let's take you into some other rooms here so here's the entryway where we came in this looks like a good movie room watch movies okay and then here's a rock entryway into a magnificent master suite. So here's a alternative access to the laundry room. I'll just show you there's a little storage and the laundry here. We'll come around back around to it. The wine cellar. Guest bath. Okay, now we're gonna come around to the Master suite. Now these mirrors are just standing up so that you can locate them wherever you want. Here's the exercise room in the master suite. This is the master suite. The lights come on up above there. I don't know if you can see the lights, but inside that coffered ceiling there is some lights. This is an outdoor alternate. You can place a bed out here and sleep outside with the screens. Very nice feature. Okay, so you got some reading lights on either end of the bed. Here's the bathroom.
Okay, you have a opening for a toilet there. There's no door on this opening, but that would not be hard to do because it's already cased in. Here's the shower. True view for the shower. That, that's the lot, the extra lot that comes with the property for privacy. That right there is the buried propane tank. That's the garden area. Okay. So the, the controls are right here, which is nice. So you can turn the water on how you want it, let it warm up, and then step in. Walk-in closet right here. Again, that's right next to the his and her sinks. All right, so all right, let me turn back around. So when you come through the master closet. There is a pocket door right here, so you don't have to have it open, but you could access your laundry room right from here. All right, we're right here, so let me go ahead and take you into the garage. Let me back up a little bit. Okay, so again, this is where we were before, a little storage door coming out of the kitchen. Okay, so here is the garage. Epoxied floors, they are sloped, so drainage is gonna be Really good under the pool table. This is a water softening system. Beverage cooler. Really nice hot water heater, on demand hot water heater. So there's two different systems there. All right. And then that's just extra storage here. And that's just all the extra paint for touch up. All right, so let's go ahead and take you on the other half of the house there. Oh, there is a sprinkler system right there. That's the controls. Electrical panel box openers. All right, let's go ahead and take you on the other half of the house here. So again, here's the entryway. Another bedroom alternative, guest room if you want. So here's a sitting area. This would be a nice little area for books to sit and read. Office area. Okay. And there's the outbuilding. Closet. And this is the other bathroom and a lot of these you've seen in the listing pictures but kind of gives you an idea for the layout of things and then the other bedroom Okay, so here we are outside from the dining room. A little grill there. Okay, so let me go ahead and take you out to see the, the uh, creek. That's wood storage, but that can be used alternatively for anything else. Now this right here is a path that goes down and switches back around to a lower level on the property closer to the creek at the edge of the property here. Hopefully you can see that. Just gorgeous. Lots of privacy and We'll go ahead and show you the outbuilding. 
take you through the uh, outbuilding here and some of the features. Uh, there's a Laura sighting right there. Okay, here we go. So, this is the main entrance right here into the side. Now, before we go in, I just want to show you a couple things. Uh, this right here, Chris, how many watts again? 35. 35, uh, 35 kilowatt, right. So, <laughs> 35,000 watt generator here. This can actually power a very large number of homes. And uh, all it needs is the uh, propane to be hooked up to. There's even a contact here for servicing it. Um, the power, the main power coming in, there's the transformer and the panel for the home and the shop. You can actually wire this directly to the generator have a separate propane tank for the generator, get somebody hooking that up and you have a backup, it'll power everything if the power ever goes out. Very nice feature you don't see on your average home. All right, there's a option to hook up a generator right there. Um, okay, going into the shop, so you have a workbench, heat it up with a wood stove right there. Big storage loft, workbench. Little sink, it doesn't look like there's any uh, faucet for the sink, there might not be any plumbing right now. Yeah, they're just using it with a bucket up underneath, so no plumbing in here right now. They do have a, it's wired for a dust collector. Dust collector is not present on site, but you do have the hookups for it, and then there's a back room here. All right. No. I don't want to make the video too long here. And then over to the side. You have one more lean-to over here. You have another a number of uh, outlets, and then uh, you have a uh, a dump right there that you can, if you have an RV parked out here, you can hook it up and uh, dump into your septic system right there. So, okay, that's it. Oh, one other thing, the property does go up a little ways into the trees over here. Okay, so you do have a nice buffer zone. And let me take you over to the side because I haven't shown you this yet. This is the neighboring five acres. You can actually have a home built here if you wanted to, but uh, the current owner bought it for privacy. Okay, that's it. Hope you like it. Hope you're thinking the same thing about it as we are. We'll talk to you soon. Park right here. Okay.
Okay, so this is the community center. Uh, something that is part of your uh, HOA fee that you get to uh, have as an amenity. Again, there's a little pond over there we'll check out. Looks like the landscaping yard care crew is hard at it. Super nice. Okay, so that's all for now. We'll, uh, again, talk to you soon. Hopefully, uh, this will be the right one for you. What do you think, babe? Mama likes it. If mama's happy, we're all happy. All right. We're Will and Laura Realty. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like and subscribe button. If you live in North Idaho, or would like to live in North Idaho, give, give us, us a call. call.